Hey guys, what is up? I am Double Driven. New patch. Um, some fun things going on uh, in Gwent with the, the changes. They changed the economy. I can't believe they did that. To where you could buy powder and stuff for your reward points. That's just bonkers. I mean, that's absolutely crazy that they're letting you trade these resources in to improve your collection. Um, I guess they feel like the game's been out for so long that... Uh, the newer players maybe they don't don't really want to play the um reward map and stuff they just want to build their collection up so shout out to them man that's incredible um this is what i came up with uh there was a couple changes to um the flanking um uh, you know i i really like this spotter card um being able to play a card and then pick um, to put vitality on it and then do it again to see their their cards like sometimes these play for like 12s you know if you hit a seven or an eight you know that's pretty good 15 for four um and it's protected with the armor until you want to use it sometimes you don't even have to use it you know you could just wait um but the idea of the deck i guess it depends on what you're going up against um you know we do have the ramon uh Vrygef and vermeed um uh, the Vrygef gets a little weird, um, especially if there's only one unit on the, or, you know, you want that flanking, so they want to be on the end, but, I mean, if you can get it between two Nausicaa Sergeants, that's what you're going for, really. Um, the Pikemen are fun, putting them on the ends. I do have De La Tour in here to possibly make sure you always have your flanking ready to go. <clears throat> the Recruits are really nice, even in round three, in case you miss your... Um, sergeants you can maybe put a boost boost on them put them on the end and then uh, you know one armor and uh or getting them up to you know six is kind of hard to kill and then you can grab up your sergeant uh, a couple milf guardian knights for openers uh pretty great uh, but and then there's a couple illusions here you might be able to grab something up easy uh, we do have a mirror in here you do have damage you know so if you could Get some of these pings or even strategically play some of your bleeds you might be able to grab up some of their cards it makes them nervous too they don't know what it is they're just like that ah. you know you could probably switch it out for something like i don't know a beauclair or something if you wanted to i just uh the old school in me i still can't believe they changed yurden and igni man i mean i i never thought i'd live in a world where yurden couldn't give you a last say i mean that's just huge um i guess too you could even go Renfrey. That's a thought. I mean, there's no spells in it, so you can go, you know, a mirror, maybe downgrade one, and maybe we'll play and make another video just for that. Um, we'd have to probably drop a knight, you know, but yeah, that's a possibility too. Um, and then maybe you can also too grab up the the bandits that shuffle or whatever. I mean, you're just going for. You know thing but yeah that might even be a an option maybe we'll make another video just for that with this list but uh uh we had a tie the one game it was pretty epic i thought and then um a couple other good games so uh i think three three games two two wins and a tie spoilers but uh thank you guys so much for everything you're wonderful i will see you guys at the end so we got to get a long round we definitely got to get a but we also, too, can't go into a long round versus this. Because we don't have a home run. So we gotta go in pretty heavy on this. Um, so we could play these on both. We don't want this. We don't want these either. I guess we could end up killing something. Shit. No Vilgaforts. Vilgaforts would be huge this round. Yeah, it's the shenanigans. Um, so we can actually get the bleeding going. So I think we do it. But I don't think we win a long round versus this horse shit. So we put bleeding on 
this stuff and we can maybe keep pace. That's fine. We just need some more bleed. I think we can get more bleeding. I'm not sure. We gotta go all out. Patience is not a virtue I am known to have. Oh, that's huge. That's huge. So these should both trigger. If we get anything to one, we could seize it. So he, he bleeds this. That's fine. So we get our own bleed. Um... We just play this. Because we're going to Vilga Forts it anyways, right? Um... So this shuffles it back in the deck. What would we want to pull? Another knight? Lieutenant Flowers will lead the scouts. That's fine. Hundred and one, hundred and two, hundred and three. Now we have the ability to flank some things. That loft too. Wow. Yeah, we we got to be careful. Um. So we, I guess we try to get these these ones that are shielded. Um. So first we play our soldier. And Ah, we Ah, uh, we could play it here, right? We need one more row here, though. We have to be careful. Um, and then hopefully... Forty-four. Twenty-one. Do we burn as Regis if we do this? Um... Nothing died yet, right? This is going to die, so we put some bleeds here. Um, uh, yeah, that dies, so that's fine. We could pull this, but I think we go... Well, this one doesn't have spying. So I think we put one here. One here, and I think we just do it and see if we can ruin his day. It's not too bad, but we're filled up on this row now, so. Oh, no, we're not. That's all right. Um, so we got. Vrymede. Ah, that hurts so bad. But we could steal this here pretty... S oh, we can't. We get this one. Is there a way that we can get this one?
we don't have any bleeds. I mean, we still have the spotters, right? And what's his name? So we move this one here. We move this one here. And steal this. And we play the black battle prep for here. Now we got double pings with the possibility to grab the Detloff, but we have no bleeding. Forty nine. So we boost up the eights. Now we boost these up, right? We boot these guys up. Well, we don't want to go too tall. I guess we go here. Same thing, right? One, two, three. They're not going to want to go too much deeper, right? Problem is, is my melee row is... Oh, it'll... We can play that anywhere now. That's good. Igni! So he gets a 10. I can still catch up. Because if that's Regis, I went on even. So. We go here. 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 To here. Play this here. For the great sun. I don't think he plays it. I have a decent amount of armor going on here. I don't think he plays it. I lose two. I go to 49. Oh. Oh, we end in a tie. Do we take the tie? No. What do you mean overcommitting? I go to 48 and he goes to 48. And then we got to try to bleed that out of them. I could get, if I can get these and then save these. Pulling those eights maybe was a problem. Um, I don't have any bleeds left, do I? Trigger abilities. This is only a one now. I don't think the spotter is good. Or this, because I don't have any bleeds. Top three, so max it's going to be a five. Ah, uh, this is awkward, because these are both orders. Yeah, I think it's going to get weird. I think we lost. Is that a literal? It's a 9. That's not all there yet. 
stays up by one. And I could use the ability. Um... Eighteen, can he do it in one card? I don't think so. So we might get the good card out of him. I lose two, he still has to play one more. So the bleed might, ah. Shit. But we still could have the Nausicaa's. And the Vrygefs could actually go last say on him. So it might work out okay. Ah, that's not good, that's good. That's okay. Um, come on, Nausicaa. Yeah, baby. This might be really good. So we put it in the middle. And then we have a huge finisher. He, he's going to have a, like a 22 point uh, thing. But I think we got him easy. This combo is really nice. If you can get it to pop off. Necrat. So he's going to get six out of that. And that's getting the Igni out of him early too. Because you imagine if this was Igni. Well, he would have messed it up. So this is like 22. Ah, oh, it's an 11. We still win. <laughs> Very good. Very good. I think that completed our Regis card. Now this got nerfed pretty good, so. Let's get this over with. But it's still gonna run probably Saskia and all the other shenanigans. Um, this might be okay. We don't want Nausicaa's round one, and we don't want the Illusionist's round one. These are okay. We could play them both, one and two. I don't think I want Damien round one. I feel like I gotta go in against this stuff. <gasps> um, so we go here first. Chariot. So they're spawning to. So they want to do the pings. Uh, do we go with these or do we go with these? If they want to convert these, we play this, right? Which I think we do. Because they kind of lose point. Well, we get our points back, right? I think next we go cavalry and a ping on it. Yeah, he's gonna f he's gonna flip these, right? We're wax, so that's gonna give me my leader ability. That's fine. I'll take it. That's gonna. I guess we just because we could steal a lot of stuff, right? Um, I don't think we play this yet. I think we get these going. I mean, if this works out, great. But if it doesn't, it's not a big deal. We get this other one down. This doesn't have anything to do with flanking. I guess we could just play the... That's fine. If he wants to kill that, that's no big deal. Um, so he's going to put an armor on. Okay, so he gets double pings. So this always dies to the bomb. So 
So we go here. Oh, I played that in the wrong spot. We'll get it outside. Because now he's got to hope it hits it, right? This doesn't need flanking. We could play it in the middle. Him using those leader charges early, though, is kind of huge. Double chariot. Hmm. He's going to use the charges. That's fine. Um... Um, because he gets two pings, so uh, it's a one and three. I think we go here and here because we could still get our ability, right. Yeah, he's full no unit shenanigans. Everything we play will die. So we have to bleed this as well. They have a last say gourd. So we could pass. Is it worth it? I don't I think I, I honestly I think we're going to see traps and shit too. This automatically dies and we don't have the flanking for it. I think we go here. I don't think we're going to have anything to hit anyways. Him getting these double pings here is really nice for him. I can play this in the middle. Thirteen. Man, I wish I had Vilgaforts. It'd be so good right now. Um Crap, we have to go here. One, two. I think we give it another flip. They're running, they gotta be running low on stuff too, though. Just sucks that this engine is just pumping it out for them. Ah, oh, that really sucks. So this always dies if I play it back here. This doesn't do a whole lot. Oh, we have Defender. Oh, shit. I just nullified this. That's okay, we could play it. Uh we play it here, right? We conquered Gesso. These Nordling scum are no better. This should get us out, yes, thank you. Alright, so thing always dies now, so we don't we just play it. The problem is he has three carryover. Like this eats us up. Plus two he has the seven. Um, the Vilgaforts might be good. Um, we have to bleed though. Is this any good? It just gives us a charge for bleeding. Is that going to be too slow? What's left? 
De La Tour. Some BS. We don't want these. I think this is fine. He can't kill it. I'm not going to have anything to hit, I don't think. So he goes ping, ping. Well, he has to be careful here. Well, he has to go bomb. Yeah, I have to hope for these at the end. Yeah, he has to go bomb, ping. Oh, he can't do it. Yeah, he can do it. That. Bomb, ping, and he uses his leader ability. But he might have bricked his leader. Okay, it went on the wrong row. Does he really let it live? That's fine. We just keep all the bomb. We just bleed it for all it's got. We want to try to pick up something big. Everything's going to die anyways, right? He's played one, two, two. So he should still have like three more, maybe, f eh, three more, yeah. Yeah. Because this is carryover, right? If we can get this out of him, we're happy. I just want to get one good unit out of him. It, it, at least the... So he's doomed as a Nero. That's fine. You are dogs, and I shall treat you as such. He always plays Gord last, so maybe we try to get it out of him. Cause I'll never get to hit it, right? With the with the Panther. Pyro. Uh -oh. So if I hit this, I go to thirteen. No. Fourteen. I'd have to hit something lower than this. He's just going to play random BS. He did use Heat Wave already, which is good. He doesn't have a Nero. So he might miss things. The problem is he gets his carryover. I need two of these or I just concede. What'll really hurt is if he has a trap. If he has the thing trap, this never lives. Uh, uh, this will be good, actually. Uh, so we can go boom, boom, boom. Do we ever think we're gonna have anything to hit for Vilgaforts? Oh, it's order shit. This never lives, right? It might. We always flip this though, right? So he plays the panther first. Tiger, yeah. So he does have Gord in the deck. That's actually kind of huge. That's actually really huge. Um, this, so we might actually hit it. Well, he, his, he has no, oh, he probably has the, what's it called? So if I nuke it, he might have a dead card in hand. So I think the first chance I get, I should try to nuke. Because he might have the Call of the Forest or whatever. Uh, 
Really? I think we do it now. Well, we have two order cards, unfortunately. He always plays it last, though, right? So we have to play this. Oh, but we get to prep it. That's nice. So we prep this, then we could play another one of these, possibly. And then maybe nuke his gourd. That kind of hurts. Um, so we go back row, play this. Because we have armor here, right? We hit this five, because we're going melee. He never plays Gord, so if I can hit... If I can hit the Gord, I think I might win. Because he's going to have a dead card, right? Because he's got Call of the Forest. And it's a four, maybe? Oh, well... This goes back in the deck, unfortunately. So maybe we don't even play it. I guess we see what we hit, right? So we... Oh, he gets to lock it. Shit. Alright, so... Really? Gord. We got a one. Gord is 13. Oh, but he keeps the seven. Shit. That's 11. He wins by two points. Muzzle. Hi. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. That was rough. That was super rough. All right. Ooh, so assimilate, I'm guessing. We go first. Alright, so we gotta turn one play. Get rid of the Nausicaas. And the Illusionists. Okay. Um So we go Nilfgaard first. Knight. Seven, eight, okay. The only problem is this is going to ping this. We play this outright. We play this. We need these for the next round. So I think we go here. Give it a ping. It's flanked. We could start giving some bleeding. I think next we go Emir. So nomadic. Um. Pick a card to play. Let's go spotter. You get six armor on it. It's pretty huge. We can do this again. So he's got those in deck. But I think we want to get our engines down. Ah, eh, not necessarily. Seems like it's. Yeah. Definitely seems like it's. Uh... I could see Vilgaforts coming down. Ah. 
I don't think we hit this. I think they're playing Vilgaforts. Or they have a reset. There's a reason why you play this. And not here. Maybe they... Well, I mean... So we go four. It's not bad. It's not bad. Megascope eight. This has got to be a super day list. It has to be. So they're going to get eight. This should get us there, I would think. We still have the, our defender. These are pretty good cards. Mana, so this draws this draws us something good. We're happy with it, right? It's definitely Rodea and Shoop and shit. Wait, what yeah, this doesn't need flanking. Must be an important lesson in this. Try to get these if we can with Amir. I will play this. I guess we try to get another pikeman down. Or do we go for the cro double crossbowman? We have to have something to play with our thing, but we can also go sergeant. Unfortunately, we can't get, uh, I think we got to pass here because he's going to play what's it called and it's going to shift super hard, right? He's going to play Ivar. He could still have Ivar. It's definitely a shoe plus though. He has to get a six here. Okay, so he banished an eight. I think we're okay with it. Uh, the only problem is if he has a if he can get the long round out of us. Or the short round out of us. Definitely don't want that. I think we have to hang on to this. Just for the fact. This is our dry pass play. If he bleeds, we just go straight into this. This is our drive pass play. What do we pick up? We pick up an eight pot, double eights. We need that for these, but this. I think we get rid of this. Okay, so this is huge. So let's see if he bleeds us, which I think he's going to. I mean, if I go into the last round with this, I think I'm happy. This is going to be... Okay. We're plenty happy with this. Six. He shouldn't be able to take this out. We'll give it the old loop-de-loop -loop here in a second. We go here, 
illusionist. That's totally fine. Um. We know he's gonna have low provision spells, so we keep that going. Next we play them illusionist, then go I guess we go tortoise? Man, I wish I had Vilga for it. This thing would have got nuked. So he's going to go Ivar for that. We have to go here. Uh, oh, we should have went here because of the armor. So we lost a couple points there. But we keep pinging, right? I mean... So Ivar hits here. <laughs> I think if we can keep the these for the last round, we might be okay. No point in gossling. Ah. So that hits pretty hard. It's not that great. Oh, so here's, here's his eye bar. So didn't he make this thing void? We go Vrygef now while we can. That's fine. I, I mean, it's it's points, right? And it's not boosting high. I think we saved the De La Tour. Ivar can't go yet, though, right? 29, so this is... So he boosts it up one more time. So we play the thing because this is going to die and see if he stops. Because he's going to hit a 20 with Vilga Forts, right? That pulls possibly a 1. It could pull an 8. And we still have possibly 3 soldiers. This is the only problem, right? So that's going to be Vilga Forts. If we hit an 8, it's not that bad. So it's just regular Geralt. Okay. So that's a 23 point swing. Is that that bad? So we go... This isn't going to be that great the last round, right? So we go here. We just hit this. We go here, here. Here, here. Can we catch up? We can, right? Here and here, right? We're up one. Well, we had points here. This doesn't really do anything. We lose this. But as long as we could draw the sergeants, I think we're fine. We went a little bit haywire here. We still got one more point. But I think as long as there's not like a shoot steal or something. Because it's all ones, right? So far, it's all been one of us. 
So this we could draw. This pulls whatever. Yoga Fort's in the thing. Um, maybe we maybe we drop this. It's only gonna play for like a six, seven, eight. Okay, so we get their last card. Um, I think we go here. We have to do it. It's just too good, right? Um, we play this here. I guess if we would have got the eight, that would have been pretty good. So this is going to play for eight as well. If they go something huge, we get the new kit, right? I mean, that's... What am I going to pull? One of these? Do we leave it go? He's got to have like a low provision card. Um, like tourney jousts have to be in here somewhere. But I boost this up and he has something big. The Ivar could be like really deadly though. So we pull... I think we just pull the Knight last and go Vilga Forts, right? If it lives. Wow, this thing thinned all the way to nothing. Wait, that doesn't do anything. We played around it. <laughs> we played around it. Beautiful. Um, so, Sh Shoop and Radea? Ah. So he's going to reset this. Set an allied unit's power to match the highest unit. Reset the power of this unit. So we go down 11. We kill this anyways. So we just go here. Here. And here. And we burn his last card, right? Because he might be looking to pull it. There's no card left. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. That was so good. Great game there. GG. Hey, that's the video for today, guys. Let me know what you think. I really like the flanking uh, thing. That deck was really cool, though, man. It thinned to one. Um, I thought it was a shoop list, but uh, it was not. So, uh, fun games. You guys are wonderful. Thank you so much for everything. All the well wishes and um, just being awesome, man. For sticking around. I know I've had a lot of problems lately. And I haven't been able to make some content. But I'm just grateful for the people that stick around, man. You're wonderful. I'll see you guys next time.